Hi, this is Cover Ups coming to you with another milk paint demonstration from the Real Milk Paint Company of which we're a distributor. This old lane cedar chest is beautiful on the inside. It has the tray with the felt, but unfortunately it was very scratched up and um, the wood was dry and discolored. So after a good stripping, we decided it really needed to be painted. It would look best with old milk paint since it's already an antique. So what we have here is we've mixed the Ultra Bond adhesive. Um, it's an additive that helps the milk paint stick. Um, the anti-foaming agent helps with bubbles. Also, letting it sit 20 minutes is helpful too. And then I used a little less water than normal. Um, this is what it looks like. And so it's a little more watery than regular paint. But it goes on nice and smooth, especially with the additive product. That helps a lot. Sometimes it takes two coats of milk paint. Sometimes it only takes one. It depends on how you want it to look. If you want to distress it back. In this case, I think we will distress it back a little bit. And then on another time, we'll talk about all of the different waxes and burnishing pastes and varnish that you can use over milk paint and how those work. Thanks for visiting.